Hello, my loves. I hope everybody is safe, happy, healthy, and doing well. Hello, my loves. All right, let's go ahead and get started here for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Um, so, guys, we are going to um, do some channeled messages, some oracle, and then we're going to get into the reading. So, Libra, gosh, I feel like you guys have overcome so much. There was something that hurt you so deeply. Um, and what's worse is I feel like it's the disappointment that it, you know, whatever it was didn't work out. Um, some of you may even be mourning a loved one possibly, but I feel like it has made you so strong. I mean, you have really spiritually ascended from this. You have healed, okay? Um, the problem is, is that I feel that even though you're not thinking of this person anymore, even though you're not, uh, they're not on your mind, you're not, you know, you're, you've kind of moved past it, you haven't totally overcome uh, the healing here. Because Libra, I feel like some of you may be coming into this energy of, I just want someone to take me out on a date, I just want to have, you know, a sex toy. I I'm not looking to receive love or give love to anybody. I'm done with relationships. So Libra, you're just in this energy of, you know, take me out. I'll take you out, whatever. We'll have a good time and then leave me alone. Like do not start with that lovey-dovey crap. I don't want to date nobody. I'm not. So I feel like you've overcome a tremendous amount. You've done a tremendous amount of inner healing, but not enough to trust in love again. Okay, so let's go ahead and pull some Oracle here. Sorry guys, I'm quitting smoking. So I'm going to do a couple puffs here. Let's see what we have here for Libra. Nothing will come of the situation and perfect timing. So Libra, I feel here that you're, okay, I feel that you're getting yourself involved in situations where nothing's, you don't want nothing to come, you don't want anything to come of the situation. Um, with perfect timing, I feel like this is what you've lost your faith in. You've lost, you've lost your faith in divine timing. You've lost your faith in, you know, things will come to you when they're supposed to come to you. Um, I feel like you just, you don't care. You want relationships that are going nowhere. You're just done believing in love. You're done believing in relationships. You're done believing that there's anybody good left in the world. So you have healed a lot. You just, you know what I'm saying? You just haven't, um, sorry guys. Okay. Let's see. Ooh. Clarity, guidance, love messages for my Libras, please. Okay, door to spirit, first chakra. I, I told you, Libra, you guys have ascended spiritually. You've learned how to ground. You've really centered yourself spiritually, um, which is amazing, which is absolutely amazing. Um, but you've just come to this decision that you just don't want it. You just want friends with benefits, whatever the case may be. You're just not looking for... Um, family and stuck energy and conflict. I feel like your family doesn't like this. Your kids may not like this. Um, I feel that people are trying to stop you from entering into this cycle. Okay. People are fighting you and saying, what are you doing? You know what I'm saying? What are you? You just want to have fun. You're just, you're just out to have fun. Libra, you just don't, it's like, it's just, I don't care anymore. It's like, y'all want to play? Okay. <laughs> it's like, if you can't beat them, join them. Right, Libra? Like, if you guys want to play, you know, anything you can do, I can do better. So let's, let's, let's get popping. You know what I'm saying? So Libra, you're just going out, you know, pay for my dinner, do whatever. Let's, let's do this. And don't call me in the morning. I don't even want to, I'm not even, I'm going to give you a fake number. You can call them, you know. So you just, uh, you just don't want it. You just don't want to deal with it. Um, I was going to do something. What am I doing? Okay, so Libra, let me pull from, uh, I made my own Oracle deck. 
it is ginormous. So we're going to break it up into three and we're going to pull one card from each pile, okay? Messages for Libra, please, Spirit. Messages for Libra, please. Tell me about Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Tell me about Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. <laughs> Libra, are, what are you, what are you doing, Libra? <laughs> Put on something sexy. So Libra, emotionally unavailable. I'm going to take it, Libra. I'm going to take it. You are trying to put on something sexy and you are not even like, I'm telling you, don't even talk to me. Like, don't, don't even, you know, you are emotionally not in it. You are not in it. You just want to feel good, look good. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm actually seeing some of you guys doing uh, those, um, what are they called? Bador, Bador pictures? Like those ones that are like real sexy and like those old fashioned settings, right? Like the ones with the pearls and everything. Um, Libra, you're just out to have fun. You're hitting it and quitting it. <laughs> I'm actually thinking about that movie. What's the movie with the blonde chick where she does that? She just like uses guys and leaves. Um, oh gosh, I wish I could remember the movie. Okay, let's see here. Tell me about Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. My friends love you. Third party friend. So, here's the deal. I feel that... Libra, I feel that you, as I said, just are kind of like in this friend with benefits situation and you may have like their friends falling in love with you. Like, it's just, you know what it is, Libra, when you're not chasing love, when you're not chasing relationships, everyone falls in love with you. So I feel like you're meeting people. Okay, and then you see how that said third party friend, you're meeting people and their friends are trying to get with you and you're like, you know what I'm saying? Their friends are even trying to get with you. Like everyone's trying to get with you right now because why? You're unattainable. You have become unattainable. All right. Uh, tell me about Libra, please. Tell me about Libra, please. Tell me about Libra. We've got stop accusing. Tell me about Libra, please. Tell me about Libra. And again, my family loves you. Um, okay, so I think this is the family that we talked about. Yeah, I, I think this is the family situation that we talked about. Um, I feel that there's family here that's accusing possibly Libra. Your family, your friends and your family possibly don't like this. Like they really don't like that, like this. Like maybe they're accusing you of being too promiscuous or of, you know what I'm saying, not having control over yourself, partying too much, going out with too many different people. There's people around you that don't like this. They're, they don't like this. So let's see what we have here, Libra. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. This is like a whole new you type of deal. Tell me about Libra, please. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Please, oh please, some of my Venus. Oh my Lanta. Okay. So we have the Two of Cups in the reverse, Three of Pentacles. We've got the Five of Cups, and we have the Tower. Libra, you are just straight up. You are just breaking everyone's heart, Libra. I feel like you've got people here that think that, you know, it's going to be a more than friends situation and two of cups in the reverse. You don't want nothing with nobody. Five of cups in the tower. I feel like there's like, Hey, you know, I'm sorry to disappoint you. Sorry to disappoint you, but no, 
I don't want you. I don't want your friend. I don't want you. No, I don't want nobody. Um, with the high priestess and the emperor here, again, Libra, I do feel like you've ascended spiritually, but the high priestess, especially Libra, if you're a woman, okay? Um, if, if men feel like they cannot have you, which is what's happening because you're emotionally unavailable with the emperor card here, you're standing your ground, you're in control of yourself that is where you're going to get these people that are now going to become obsessive over you. Um, and you're just like disappointing everybody because you're like, nope, I'm good. I don't need nobody. I don't need nothing. I don't need nothing. Three of pentacles here for Libra, please. Two of cups in <laughs> Libra. Oh my gosh. You just want to be friends with people. You just want to keep things mutual. We'll hang out. And I feel like you're honest about it. It's not like you're playing people. It's not like you're saying, like, you're, you're not stringing people along, Libra. You know what I'm saying? But two of cups in the reverse twice. You are letting people know, I do not want to be in a relationship. Two of cups in the reverse. The knight of pentacles. I will date you. We'll go out. We'll have a good time. But I'm not looking to give to anything that's just going to cause me betrayal and heartache I'm, I'm not looking to do that yeah see uh queen of swords and the six of cups you have ascended a lot you have healed a lot but libra this whatever it was that hurt you this past thing has just destroyed your hope in in they 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 took away your 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 dream of love your hope of love um, five of cups here for Libra, nine of pentacles. Listen, I'm good. I can take care of myself. I'm independent. I want to be single. I'm sorry. Not sorry. I got to go. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You're just like, you're disappointing a lot of people because you want to stay single. Tell me about the tower here. We've got temperance, Sagittarian energy, and the four of swords. Um, I feel Libra that again, these, the, you're, you're, these relationships or these people, um, they're not working out because you still need to heal, Libra. You're, you're just not that into it because you need to heal. Yeah, you just still need to heal. All right, tell me about Libra, please. Sun, moon, rising, Venus. Tell me about Libra, please. Sun, moon, rising, Venus. Okay, your mom may be telling you to stop, Libra. Okay, mom is telling you to go home. <laughs> uh, you know, Empress energy here. This could be a parent saying the chariot. I don't like this road that you're going down. Tell me about Libra, please. Sun, moon, rising, and Venus. Libra, please. Tell me about Libra, sun, moon, rising, and Venus. Okay. Three of swords. And the eight of wands, six of cups in the reverse, the five of pentacles. So Libra, I feel here that there may be a parent figure that doesn't like where you're going. I feel like um, this person is trying to communicate with you that, listen, you're too hurt to be going out, dating people, doing whatever. Um, that's one thing I'm feeling. Another thing I'm feeling, Libra, is that you feel like the idea of being an empress or an emperor, being in a relationship, being committed, starting a life with somebody, having children with somebody is a bad idea. It's a bad idea. People make promises, they talk a lot, and it always ends up with your heart being broken. With the Six of Cups and the Five of Pentacles, <sighs> Libra, this could be childhood trauma, but I know I don't. I, I feel more that this is some a, a relationship that has just um, broken your heart to the point that now you're almost in Five of Pentacles mode, where you are in constant. When you think about committed relationships. There's such a fear that overcomes you of going through the pain that this person put you through that you just don't want to deal with it. 
You want to talk to people. You want to go out. You want to have a good time. You want it to be fun. You want it to be reckless. And then with the death card and the four of pentacles, you want to never pick up the phone again. You're you're just taking what you need from people and ending the situations here. That's it. You, you've just had enough of empty promises. Tell me about the Empress here for Libra. Six of Wands in the reverse. Tell me about the Chariot in the reverse for Libra. Queen of Cups in the reverse. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy. Again, there may be a parent here, Libra, that's telling you that you don't need this type of negative attention. These are people that don't love you. And you're like, that's okay, because that's what I'm looking for, right? Um, now, Libra, going back to the second aspect here, I feel like, Libra, you don't feel like there's any victory in being committed and loyal to somebody. There's no victory in being a wife or a husband. It's just like those type of people don't win. Do you understand? Um, the people that, that do win um, are the people that don't care. And that's this mentality that you're stuck in. You know, the people that do win or the people that aren't good, aren't loving, you know. Tell me about the Three of Swords here for Libra. Knight of Swords in the Reverse Aquarius, Gemini, Libra energy. Um, you want to stay away from anybody that has the potential to break your heart. If, if You know what I'm saying? Um, Eight of Wands and the King of Pentacles in the reverse. You'll talk to people, you'll have sex with people, but you, um, you, f you feel like the lesson that you've learned here, the wisdom that you've learned is to not give crap to anybody, to hold, you know what I'm saying, to be selfish, take, and just walk away. Um, I feel like you are... I feel like you want to talk to people, but you don't want the commitment. You're actually looking for people that just want to be friends. You're you're just not even expecting it from people. You don't want it. Um, tell me about the outcome here for Libra. Tell me about the outcome here for Libra. The Knight of Wands. The Four of Swords in the reverse. And the Justice card, Libra Energy. Libra, the outcome here is that um, you're just in fun mode. You're just in player mode, fun mode, whatever you want to call it. Four of Swords in the reverse. You're done sitting in bed. You're done, you know what I'm saying? I feel like you think that you have healed when you haven't. And with the Justice card, you feel like this is only fair. You feel like you've tried over and over, over and over again um, to be a kind and loving person and partner, and it just hasn't worked out. And now you're just like, listen, this is what's fair for me to just go and do what I got to do and that's it. Ace of Pentacles and the Queen of Wands. Um, Libra, I feel like you're starting this whole new chapter of your life where, you know, the Queen of Wands is very sexy. The Queen of Wands is very independent. The Queen of Wands travels, gets up, does her own thing. The Queen of Wands is, you know, out to three in the morning partying, up at 7 a.m., ready to go run a company. You know what I'm saying? Um, you're just killing it here. Tell me about the challenge for Libra. The challenge for Libra. Tell me about the challenge for Libra. Three of Cups in the reverse. The Six of Pentacles. And the Judgment card in the reverse. Libra, the challenge here is that... You may be partying a little too much, spending a little too much money, making negative decisions. Okay, don't forget, um, don't forget with the Sun card and the Ace of Swords, you know, just don't lose yourself in this. And this may be why fr friends and family members are getting a little worried. Um, you may be spending money recklessly. You're giving your time and attention. It, it's just. You know what I'm saying? Too much. You may get to a point where you can't even afford to do this anymore. So just be careful with where you're spending your money, your time and attention. Make sure that you're aware of like your finances, where you're going, what you're doing. Do you see what I'm saying? Um, 
because living a lifestyle like that could get very reckless very quickly. So just be careful with that. Don't make too many bad decisions, all right? I love you guys so much and take care.